Hello again, fine people. Welcome back to uh, my Sims 2 playthrough. Uh, obviously, this is part 5 already. This is the thing. It's just so easy to make videos of this because obviously when you play a game like this you can't just play for like maybe say an hour and then put like a 10 minute video together that's going to be of any relevance so i mean i am gonna i do try and keep these videos about 30 minutes ish because obviously you know i could easily make these videos two hours long <laughs> but then you would just get bored because nothing new is really happening and whatever uh okay so i can't i can't actually remember what i had done or what i had showed you in the last video uh, I, I, did i have i don't know if i had the toilet and shower but there they are anyway in that little uh, room um, new table and chairs this is to basically just help with the environment of the room because uh, see how it's quite high and that's because these add environment points to the room so yeah I've got the new uh, table and chairs there in the kitchen uh, I've also replaced the desk that old sort of uh, what was it called? The the whoosh desk <laughs> or something like that, which was, uh, hmm, yeah. Okay, so anyway, I replaced it with a bit more of a normal desk, but this does actually give environment points to the room, so, you know, it, it helps him uh, enjoy the room better. Uh, there's a computer, obviously, the game. Uh, a new chair as well, which also adds, I think, but two points to the room. Uh, I'm not sure if I showed you last time I, I've bought the same TV well, unit, I guess you could say. Um, basically because it has a fun rating of 7, which is not bad, which is yeah, it's pretty good. But it's got a room rating of 3. If I... Uh, Let's just go into boy mode and living room electronics. Uh, ah, there it is. Now, for the price, you've got a fun rating of 7, an environment of 3. Now, when you consider that you've got something like that, which is pretty much twice the price and all it's got is just one mo one point more of fun it's kind of like why bother that was the tv that i wanted and i'm like yeah but it's just got a fun rating of eight and an environment of three so what's the point <laughs> really why spend that much when you can get a TV, uh, or a TV unit at that price, and just for the sake of one fun point. So yeah, that's what I did, I've bought that anyway. Uh, because obviously I needed to replace the TV when it got stolen, so I bought the same one. Uh, and like I said, it had environment points to the room which means the sim enjoys the room better um what else oh yes 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 what else was new i ta -da! <laughs> got rid of that female stepping wardrobe thing whatever it was and i just brought these drawers which i think these drawers had something like two or three points of environment uh, to the room so there's that and that's it I don't really use these two rooms I've got no use for them at the moment 
That's not to say I won't use them in the future. Because I, I, I doubt if I'm going to move from this house. Really. I mean, it's got loads of room, really. I mean, the bedroom, massive. You can fit loads in there. That bathroom is just ideal. I will... Actually, 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 no, will I? No. Oh, yes. I bought a mirror. Can't remember if I showed that last time. I don't think I did, but I bought a mirror. And I've already got... Uh, is that five charisma points? So, there you go. Uh, job boys, uh, I've leveled up to a power leveller. And I've already got enough uh, skill points to be promoted. So, and apparently I need one friend as well, which, well, I've got four. So there you go. Qualify uh, for that. This is the meter you need to keep up, up the top there. Because when that's at the top and you've got all the requirements, you should... What happened there? Oh, no, no. Just clog the toilet again. Really? Oh, that's seriously... <sighs> anyway, as it is... Uh, what is it? This is 10... 11pm... Ah, so... And this is the thing as well. It works from 10am to 6pm, but only four days a week. So that's a bit of... Uh, a bit of a thing... Uh, so, that's it, you're pretty much updated with the house, there's nothing new otherwise. Did I show you the finished car? I'm not sure if I did. I think in the last video I was still working on it and I was explaining basically what you do. So, yeah, there we go. There is the completed car. That means, uh, because oh, it's a change owner. Now, I didn't realise these little arrows meant that was who the current owner was, and the arrows were on nobody. I'm thinking, well, hang on a minute. I've bought that car for 800 simoleons. I've just spent all this time buffering up the bodywork, messing with the engine, and doing God knows what. And you're telling me that nobody owns the car? Literally, I do, because I bought it, I did it up, so, yeah. But now I own the car, I don't need to have that crappy uh, old banger that comes to pick me up from work every day. Uh, pick me up to go to work and to bring me back. Uh, I have got this uh, actually quite smart car. I mean, it's not bad. I mean, considering it cost 800 simoleons. Uh, and you do it up yourself. You know, it's uh, it's actually pretty smart. It's worth eight hundred simoleons. I tell you, you know what I mean, it's uh, it is not bad at all. So yeah. And speaking of which, um, let's go somewhere. Uh. Let's see. Because we, we we should get the uh, the box pop up in a minute. Um, the box should pop up. There we go. Where would you like to go? Well, locally, you've got um, hmm, clothing store, fine affair market, Freya's Raiment. Adorn yourself as a goddess when you shop. Oh, yeah, it's really not for me, is it then? <laughs> Gamesend Ground. The Gamesend, or Gamasend, whatever, family donated their most beautiful piece of land to the city of Belladonna Cove to provide the perfect place to rest those tired bones. That sounds like a cemetery to me. <clears throat> Swift and Thrift Mini Market. If, from your money, you don't want to part, shop at Swift and Thrift Mini Mart. No. 
Okay, Blue Water Village. What do we have there? A one, two, three plus gym. Amelia's Closet. Uh, okay. The Blue Water Bass and Salon. Ah, I see. Uh, Club Dante. So what time is it? 12.55 a.m. Oh. Well, some people will be there, but... Uh, Electronics Super Center. Bam, 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 bam. The Blue Water Village Electronics Supercenter was established back in 1888, really, long before electronics of any sort existed. <laughs> the owners thought the name was uh, catchy, but the entire neighbourhood thought they were insane. Until the transistor was invented. Okay. Uh, Hunter's Park. Blah, blah, blah. Um, right. Yeah, there's quite a bit there, isn't there? Papaya Regime. The finest clothing for upscale men. Um, the Somalian Arcade. Ooh. Simoleons burning a hole in your pocket? Need a break from your MGS? You <gasps> don't own a computer? Come play with us, we've got games galore! Hobbies. Aspirational Laboratories. Will's... Ah, right. Uh, hmm. Because after finishing the car, it said something about going to Will's garage. Or garage, as some, as some people say. Uh, so what's happening downtown? Uh, ooh, Speedy's Fast Lanes Bowling and Eats. Yeah, it's got to be that, hasn't it? Uh, and so, while the transitional phase of the loading screens um, occur, I shall be cutting those out and you'll see me again when I appear at the destination. See, that's the, the handy thing about having a car as well. You can just like go anywhere, anytime you fancy. I mean, it's literally like, you know, nearly half 1am. And, uh, uh, and up comes the loading screen, so be right back. So hello, welcome to Speedy's Bowler Armor and Eats, or whatever it was called. <laughs> oh, hello. What's this? Custom radio stations. Yeah, I don't really care for the music because I cut all that out anyway. Oh, oh, oh! Is that? Oh, no, that's uh, Kathy Young. Oh, I thought that was. Uh... Yeah, I say. I thought that was uh, Callista. The girl. And the oh, come on. Does she work at. Well, does she work basically everywhere? Uh, what's he going to do? Lounge. Yeah, that's kind of typical of. Uh, <laughs> of does. Yeah, she's kind of like. Callista. Uh, Except a bit more uh, poshly dressed. And I'm trying to. Wow, she's just like the same hair, everything. Really? I mean, why would you dress like that to come to a, a bowler arm? <laughs> but wow, she's. Just like Callista. Seriously, I mean, you'd, you'd have thought there would have been a little, uh, there would have been a little more diverse in the uh, in the characters, you know what I mean? But uh, not much thought went into that one, did there? Really? Let's go say hello, oh. <laughs> Bebo. <laughs> Hello. Well, there's quite a 
few people here. Uh, but besides the bowling, I mean, there's not a lot more to do. But then again, I guess that's what it is really. It's just... It's just a bowling alley and eat. Although well, you've got pinball machines as well there. But uh, yeah, I guess you could like, have something to eat. What's he going to do? He's going to bowl. Well, why not? You're in a bowling alley. Wow, vain much. <laughs> uh, that guy is out in his... Uh, what looks like a dressing gown. <laughs> so, what's going on then? We've got about like six people all bowling at the same time. Oh no, it's paused. Let me guess. Yep. The witch is here. Francis McCullough, the atrociously evil witch. You know when she's here because the game kind of pauses for a while and she does that. Which doesn't seem to do anything. <laughs> it's, it's like, okay, what are you doing? You're atrociously evil, but you're not doing anything. You're just waving your wand. Uh, is it? Oh, right. Yeah, he's eating. Has he bought that food, or is it? Did he go and cook it himself? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like. Yeah, don't worry, I'll cook it myself. You haven't got to serve me now. I'll just, uh, yeah, don't mind me. <laughs> yes, uh, I don't think you understand how businesses work. <laughs> so who's that? Kevin Turnick. And that, that's Jeff. I thought it was a girl. No after... Oh, come on. What kind of silly name is that? Who's that there? Don Akuma. It's a bit... That's one thing that is a bit ridiculous about Sims games, is they base names on the speech. Whoa. Somebody's pregnant. Oh, is that Sonny? Ooh, hello, Sonny. First time we meet. Let's check the relationship thing here. Oh. Sonny is zero. Really? I spoke to Sonny loads of times online. Hmm. That's, that's a bit strange. So, here I am, back home. And... I will end it there. I would just like to say, I do apologise if I do tend to waffle on a bit. It's, uh, it's a bit of a habit of mine. I'd Enough of that. Uh, looks like uh, he's up for work, which uh, the alarm's gone off. And he is, uh, and he is at work today. So what I will do is I won't quite end it yet. Uh, well, he needs a shower anyway. Uh, he could probably do with. 
using the lavatory of convenience before the show, but you never know. Should be okay, I think. And so, right, uh, let's speed things up. That's it, you need to be at work in one hour, and now car to come and pick up. He's got his own car. Now more of that crappy, light, sort of cream beige, brown, knackered car. <laughs> My nice shiny car. Ooh. To work! So anyway, while he's at work, what can we talk about? Oh, there's a... Uh, there's my girl. Um, so yeah, if you've been watching this, I hope you've been enjoying it. I must admit, it, it's rekindled my love for The Sims 2. It's been quite a while since I last played. And since Origin made this Ultimate Collection available for free, I mean, it, it, it took a little while. I mean, I installed it a, well, about a week ago or so. Now, what, what's the date today? The, the date at the moment is Monday the 8th. So probably about two weeks ago, I installed, uh, I installed it. And... Because I was playing so much uh, GTA, or GTA 5 at least, and GTA Online, that I didn't really get around to playing it until now. So, right, okay, he's home, yes. Oh, come on. No potion. Man, goddamn. Oh. Who's that? Good night, Bruce. Oh, uh, what? You, bo bummer. Oh, well, he's leaving anyway. What the? Why do people do that? I just walk past and kick your bin over. Ma. <laughs> Seriously. Well, it looks like, <coughs> oh, excuse me. It looks like my girl's gonna have a shower, and then I will get this cleaned up. So I will leave it there. Um, sorry, it wasn't very exciting. I mean, it, this is The Sims, really. It's not something you can really sort of, I don't know, do. As I mean, I'm trying to like get things done, uh, you know, uh, basically trying to make this as entertaining as possible. But it's it is pretty hard, really, because the things that you have to do kind of don't let you do that very very well. But, uh, but I will try, I will th try and think of things that I can do. Um, if you have any suggestions, please leave a comment if you're watching this. Um, and like I said in the last video, if you want to like the video, like it. If you want to subscribe, please subscribe. That's entirely up to you. And uh, I'll thank you for watching. So until next time... Bye!